Hello. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Welcome. Good evening. Good evening. Hi, teacher. What is this? Hello. Hello, 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 hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. On. Okay, hello. Hello, tell me. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes. Yes. Yes, okay. yes teacher. Just let me know, please. Good evening, teacher. Hello. Okay, um, yes, uh, we are going to wait a little bit for the rest and then we are going to start. <clears throat> Mm -hmm. 
Okay, let me see how many people do we have now? 11, okay. Let me introduce my topic for today. Okay, today is uh, class 17. And our topic for today is how to use good light too. But before to talk about this, we are going to make a review about the previous one. And you are going to tell me what do you remember about the previous topic. So you can start telling me what do you think about. Antes de iniciar con el tema de hoy, vamos a hacer con un repaso uh, sobre lo que vimos el día de ayer. Y después de eso, vamos a dar inicio con el tema de hoy. Ok, who wants to start? Teacher, I remember the topic, way to report a problem. Oh, okay. how, how to report a problem? Okay, eh, mencionamos algunos problemas típicos como a virus, a frozen screen, new, new software, y también creo que estudiamos cómo hacer la pregunta correcta. Eso es lo que me recuerdo, dicho. Okay, thank you. Someone else, someone else, please. ¿Quién más? ¿Quién más? Eh, teacher. Hello, good sir. Evening. Good evening. Good evening. Uh, develop, develop uh, um, speaking activities. Ah, oh, okay. okay, 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 tell us. And ab about uh, the problems, uh, why report problems in systems? Okay. Thank you, somebody else? Again, Mas? See? You can take a look at your notes if you want. Pueden tomar eh, ver sus apuntes. Okay, I'm still waiting. She was in espera. Hola, hola. Hola, hola. Ok, I'm still waiting. In order that you can tell me what do you remember about? Sí, buenas espera. Buenas noches, teacher. Buen motivo de salud estaré de oyente. Ok. Ok. 
Okay, hold on a second, please. Okay, hold on. Okay, today we are going to work on page number 42. You can take a look there if you want. in your material. Okay, let me check out for the attendance and then we are going to start. Okay, teacher. Bueno, ya también estoy mirando que ya algunos ya completaron sus unidades, eso es muy bueno. Pero todavía tengo algunos que no lo han hecho. So I invite you to do it, please. Please try to do it as soon as you can do it. Tan pronto pueda, por favor. Okay, America Elizabeth. America. Here. Ana Iris. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, welcome. Blanca Esperanza. Blanca Esperanza. No. Cecilia. Present teacher. Okay, says yes there. Uh, Edwin Alexis. Present teacher. Okay, we'll just chat to Edwin Alfredo. Present teacher. Okay. Francisco Pereira. Ya no está con nosotros. Gabriela Yamilet. Present teacher, good evening. Okay, good evening. Gisela, Gisela. Gisela. No está. Ingrid. Present. Oh, there Ingrid is there. Uh, Don Jonathan. Present teacher. Okay. Jose Ernesto Alemán. Por ahí lo vi. Don Jose Ernesto. Present teacher, good evening. Good evening, sir. Okay, Don Jose Luis. Present. Okay. 
Karina Vanessa. Present teacher. Okay, Katherine Maricela. Present teacher. Teacher two. Uh, Katherine Paola. Present teacher. Okay, step two. Uh, Candy Natalie. Present teacher. Mauricio Antonio. Present teacher. Okay, Mauricio is there too. Uh, Roxana Alvarez. Present teacher. Okay. Uh, Roxana Elizabeth. Now, Sara. I don't see Sara today. Now here, Janet. Present teacher. Janet is there. Uh, Yesenia Lisette. Present teacher. Okay, is there two? Well, here we go, here we go. Okay, let us start. Uh, well, I need to share with you my presentation. Okay, let us continue. We are going to start talking about these two questions. So I invite you to answer it. What is the most common problem with printers tell me what do you know about this teacher no les podría decir en español cuáles son los problemas más comunes de las impresoras Y la dos, how often do you use them? Con qué frecuencia las usa usted? In my case, I, I use it every day. En mi caso, las uso todos los días. Tengo que imprimir documentos. Edwin. Uh, sí, yes, teacher. In my case, uh, the, the most common problem is when when don't have uh, ink. Okay, when you don't have ink. And when repeat copies. Ah, okay. Copies, du duplicator. Okay, we need to be careful because uh, at the moment that we are going to send a file, we need to uh, specify exactly the number of the page that we want to print. Yes, but in my job, the printers are very, very modern. And when I want a print, a ingreso, a code, a code. Okay. And, and uh, can, can um, eliminate the other. Oh, really? Yes. It is difficult to delete it, or, or you can do it. It's, it's, it's easy. Okay. Well, 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 well. Okay. But in my in, in my house, it's not mother. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. That, yeah. The thing is that maybe in your <laughs> job, you have a, a, a big one like a photocopy, right? Yes. Yeah. That is the reason why. And, uh, and another thing is that uh, if uh, there are five people working in the same place, uh, all of them can send documents. And you need to be careful because suddenly somebody can send something and you uh, think that uh, is uh, your document. And maybe you are going to get confused. So for that reason, you need to be uh, really careful about it. Yeah. Okay, somebody, Ingrid, Ingrid is there, Ingrid. Uh, 
Hello, Ingrid. Hello. In my case, uh, the problem is paper stocking printer. Ah, okay. That is the, the most common for you when, when the paper is stopped in print. Mm, yeah. Okay. And how often do you use it? Uh, when I print a lot of paint, paper. Pages? Okay. Teacher. Hello. In my case, is is jumper paper. Oh, okay. I use the printer is every day. You use the printer every day? Yes, teacher. Okay. Okay, thank you, somebody else. Yeah, teacher. In my case, the most frequent problem is the, that is the only, of only. The more we now connection. We use it in the every day. Okay. Teacher, in my case, uh, the most common problem with the printer is a uh, paper stop. Paper stop, okay. And, and how do you say, olvidar la clave? Uh, you forgot the password? Así es. Eso me pasa frecuentemente y se bloquea. Ah, uh, it's a lot, okay. Okay, thank you, teacher. Okay, okay. Don't forget the password, try to keep in mind. In my case, teacher, the most common problem is when the when I don't have paper. And you don't have paper in the printer, right? Yes. Uh, and I I use them every day. Every day I use the printer. Okay. In my job. Okay. Okay, uh, Edwin Alexis. Hello, teacher. Uh, with respect to the pregunta, uh, the most common problem is related to inject nodes. They often have cobbling. The second is using the daily basis because the generate many reports. Okay, the second, the second question is how often do you use the printer? Okay, thank you.
Okay, somebody else wants to say something about? Eh, solamente con lo que quería decir, ¿verdad? Es que el problema más frecuente en lo que hay respecto a nosotros con el trabajo, eh, bueno, en la empresa del trabajo, ¿verdad? Este, es que los cartuchos de tinta suelen obstruirse muy a menudo. Ah, ok. Y, ah, y este, con respecto a la segunda pregunta, ¿verdad? Que el que tan frecuente es que lo utilizamos, lo utilizamos a diario, ¿verdad? Debido a que sacamos muchos reportes en la cual... Tenemos que sacar muchísimas páginas, a veces hasta más de 80 páginas, debido a, dependiendo del reporte. Ok, ok. Ok. ¿Someone else? Teacher, in my case, it's head paper ham, and I use it every day. You use every day too? <laughs> okay. Somebody else? Alguien más, alguien más, por favor. I need uh, all of you participate. Necesito que todos participemos, por favor. Esta es la última semana. Tell me, please. Hola, hola. Hi, teacher. Sí, tell me. This machine makes all day today for yes, sir. The toner of all copying is spent. Another problem is paper. James. Okay. Okay, thank you. Somebody else? Alguien más? No. Me teacher. Okay, tell me. Um, um, most printer problem is then from empty or look uh, or loud in cartridge. This can be due to several factors shot as the use of poor quality candles improver 
handed or installation or even in covered machine settings. And how often do you use? And from time to time. Okay. Okay, let us continue then. Okay, uh, we are going to continue with this conversation. You are going to have the chance to practice with somebody else. So I, re I recommend you to pay attention and listen in the way that I'm going to read it. This conversation is between Mike and Maria. Mike, Mike Hernandez, IT department. Hello, Mike, this is Maria Ochoa from accounting, I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Ms. Ochoa? It doesn't seem to be working and it's making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it said service. Also, there is a red light on the error button. I would like to come soon to check it. I see. I'll be there right away. Okay, questions? Questions? Teacher, message, pronunciation. Accounting, accounting. 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 No question, teacher. Okay. Quiero solamente una pregunta. Ok. Eh, para pronunciar mensaje, ¿cómo sería? Message. 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 Yes. Message. Ah, ok, perfecto. Thank you. Message. Making a strange noise. Message. No lo confundan con masaje porque eh, a, eh, la primera vocal es diferente. Repeat, teacher, please. Okay, I'm going to read again. Okay, Mike Hernandez, IT department. Hello, Mike. Okay, hold on a second, please. Listen. Mike Hernandez, IT department. Okay, hold on. Let me, let me mute to everyone. It's going to be better. Okay, Mike Hernandez, IT department. Hello, Mike. This is Maria Ochoa from Accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Mrs. Ochoa? It doesn't seem to be working and it's making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it's a service. Also, there is a red light on the error button. I would like to come soon to check it. I see. I'll be there right away. Okay. Okay. 
Buenas noches, motivo de salud está en el oyente, pronunciación de la palabra message. 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 Bueno, ahí le hemos respondido. Any questions so far from here? Preguntas? No question. No question? Okay, take a, a screenshot, please. Because you are going to need it, uh, you are going to practice. But please, uh, as soon as you get my invitation to go to the breakout room, accept it, please. Uh, tan pronto les llegue la invitación, acéptela, por favor. No me deje esperando a los demás compañeros con quien no sea asignado. Todos necesitamos hacer la práctica. Okay, five minutes is enough, I guess. Five minutes. Okay, here we go. Aquí vamos, aquí vamos. Teacher, la plataforma me sacó. ¿Really? Sí. Ahorita ingresa nuevamente. Ya veo para dónde lo envío. Sí, es que no ok. <coughs> ¿Te recuerda con quién estaba? No, teacher, yo le di a aceptar a, a, a la plataforma y se salió totalmente. Bueno, lo, lo mando a la 3. Ok, ok. Again. Hola, teacher, nuevamente. Ah, por ahí lo mandé de nuevo al, al 3. Veamos si se puede conectar.
Teacher, se me olvidó cómo se decía mensaje, dijo. Message, message. ¿Podemos leerlo con el compañero José Alemán? Okay. Iniciamos, compañero. Yes. May, May Hernández, IT Department. Hello, May. This is Maria Ochoa. From according, I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Mr. Ochoa? I doesn't seem to be working and is making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it says every also there is a red light on the iron board. I would like you to come soon to share it. I see. I will be there right away. Away. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, thank you. I guess uh, related with the question uh, and how to pronounce message, uh, in order to identify the another you know, one that is uh, kind of similar, is massage, it's different, massage. And this is message, message. Al menos yo no le siento que sea tan parecido, ¿no? Pero puede confundir, ¿sí? Ok, continue, please. Somebody else. ¿Alguien más? No, else. Me, teacher. Ok, Edwin, go ahead. With my partner, uh, Cecilia. Ok. I am here. Ok. Mike Hernandez, IT department. Hello, Mike. This is Maria Ochoa from Accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Ms. Ochoa? It doesn't seem to be working and it's making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes. It message. Says service. Yes, it says service. Also, there is a red light on the no. error bottom. I would like you to come soon to check it. I see. I'll be there right away. Okay. Okay, thank you. Don't forget uh, how you are going. Let me share with you again, and I'm going to read it because, um, okay, uh, let me see here. Okay, I'm going to read again. I don't know if you can hear very well. Just let me know if you can, or if you are able. Okay, Maya Hernandez, IT department. Hello, Mike, this is Maria Ochoa from Accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Ms. Ochoa? It doesn't seem to be working and it's making a strange noise. Is there a message, message. in the message. control panel? Message in the control panel. Yes. yes. It's it, say, it says service. service. Also, there is a red line on the bottom. Red bottom. I hope. I I would, I would like to come soon to, come check, it. Soon to check it. I see. I see. I will be right away. away. Okay. Okay, somebody else wants to do it? 
Ingrid, okay, go ahead, Ingrid. Me and my partner, Gabriela. Okay. Uh, Mike Hernandez, AT department. Hello, Mike. This is Maria Ochoa from accounting. I would like to report a problem with my prim my printer. What is the pro problem, Ms. Ochoa? It doesn't seem to, to be working and it's making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes. It says service. Also, there is a red light on the error button. I would like, I would like to come to come soon to, to check it. I see it'll be there right away. I'll be there right away. I'll be there right away. I'll 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 be there right away. Okay, somebody else. And um, me, teacher, with my partner and Jonathan. Okay, you shall. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm on start, or you, your my or, or Maria, Jonathan. Um, Maria. Okay, my Hernandez, IT department. Hello, my. This is Maria Ochoa from accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Mr. Ochoa? It doesn't seem to working easy, making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it says service also. There is a red light on the error button. I will let you come some to check. I see. I be. I'll be there right away. Okay. Thank you. Or switch the role. Yes. Don't okay. Worry. Okay. Okay. My Hernandez, ET department. Hello, my. This is Maria Ochoa from accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Mrs. Ochoa? It doesn't seem to be working. At, it is making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it says service. Also, there is a red light on the river bottom. I would like you to come soon to check it. I see. I'll be there right away. Thank you. Thank Salam. you. Thank you, Yonatan. You're welcome. Okay. Okay, somebody else? Somebody else? Me teacher, apartment is yes. Edwin. Hello. Me, Mike. 
Okay, go ahead. Mike, Mike Hernandez, e department. Hello, Mike. Team Maria Cora from Comte. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Miss Ochoa? It doesn't seem to work and it's making a strange noise. Is there a machine in the control panel? Yes, it says servers also tear a red light on the error button. It will like you to come to the big chili. I see it. It be there right now. I'll be there right away, right away. Right away. Yes, right away. Right away. Right away. It'd be right away. I'll, I'll, I'll be. I'll be there right away. Okay, right away. Okay, thank you, somebody else. Okay, next, please. Somebody else? Can continue on? Anybody else? Nadia Mas. No. Let me stop sharing. Okay. Um, well, uh, I don't know, but some of you didn't participate. Todavía faltan algunos que no han participado. No olviden que lo que les dije al inicio del módulo, que es necesaria la participación activa de todos ustedes para poder desarrollar eh, juntos las habilidades necesarias que el aprendizaje de un nuevo idioma lleva consigo. Okay, anybody else? If not, I'm going to continue. Okay, next activity that we are going to do. One second. Okay, before we go to the next slide, I would like that you pay attention about the whole place word that I have here. 
Me gustaría que le prestasen atención a las letras que están en negrita. And what can you tell me about? ¿Qué me pueden decir de ellos? Hola, hola. In Spanish. In English, my friend. But if you can do it, just tell me in Spanish. Um, me gustaría reportar un problema con mi impresora. Okay, okay. That is, uh, that is the meaning of, of, the, uh -huh. of the sentence. And now, uh, what about this one? Ah. I would like to come soon to check it. Es que le gustaría que llegara pronto a revisarla. Okay, now what can you infer about these two sentences? Sorry. Ahora qué 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 es lo que podemos concluir después de ver estas dos oraciones usando la misma estructura? Sería que la palabra good, no sé cómo se pronuncia, eh, se refiere como a futuro. Mm. Me gustaría. Ok, uh, para que se nos haga más fácil, digamos que good combinado con el siguiente verbo haría las veces de, de la palabra justamente esa, haría, me gustaría, ¿sí? De una forma cortés. I would like to report a problem with my printer. Mm -hmm. And also, uh, you need to take into account also uh, that we need to have a subject right here. Then the word good, then light, then to. In this case, we have to. I would like to report. But what about this one? I would like you to come soon to check this. It's a little different, right? But, can, but don't worry. Yes. Let me uh, let me move forward in order that you can understand how we are going to use it. Okay, take a look at this. How to use good light too. Okay, use good light too to say what you want, especially when making offers and requests. Ahora sí, ¿qué, ¿cómo voy a usar good light too? Para decir, vamos, 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 dígame. ¿Te gustaría? ¿A ella le gustaría? Ah, para decir lo que usted quiere, especialmente cuando hacemos, hacemos qué? Offer and request. ¿Qué son? Cuando solicitamos algún favor o, o requerimiento. What about offer? O necesitamos algo. Make an offer and request. Ofertas y soluciones. Ah, ok. And you, take, uh, you can take a look at this example. Singular, for example, what she would like to send the reports today. In plural, they would like to speak to a supervisor. And the second one, he'd like to meet the new employees tonight. And in plural, we like to ship this container tomorrow. Okay, started these examples, and then we, you can ask questions related with this. Go ahead. Okay, the main topic here is how you are going to use good light too. Ya dijimos que se usa para decir lo que uno quiere, especialmente cuando hace ofertas o solicitudes de algo. Keep in mind that, please. Okay, any question? Yes. Una... Sorry. <laughs> 
Salió usted. Sí, vamos allá, vamos. Bien. Una duda, Ticha. En la segunda pregunta dice Q, y luego ha puesto la D. Ahí está como contractado, se le dice, ¿verdad? Es a short way. Es una forma corta, es a contraction. Uh, we eh. use it at the moment that we speak. En vez de decir, he would like to, ahí decimos, ah. he'd like to meet the new employees tonight. Sí, se dice. Es como, uh, esa era mi, también mi duda. Es como este, ya agregado como cuando le hacemos el aire, ¿verdad? Yes, let me do something here. Um, ok, sucede que es como que yo acorto esto hasta ahí. Como abreviado. Eso lo quito, eso que acabo de hacer en rojo, en la parte que no suena. Y aquí en vez de decir we would like to, no, we'd like to ship this container tomorrow. Y es ahí donde las personas, eh, algunas dicen, no, pero es que el inglés de El Salvador no es el mismo con el de Estados Unidos y bla, 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 you know. Y por eso eh, nosotros en inglés corporativo le vamos explicando precisamente cuáles son esos cambios que hay que hacer at the moment that we are going to speak with somebody else. When you write something, cuando escribes, puedes usar la parte de arriba and, y cuando hablas, usas la parte corta. ¿Sí? Ok, al inicio posiblemente ustedes se pregunten y dicen, wow, pero ¿y cómo yo voy a saber cuando me estén diciendo algo referente a eso? Sí. Ahí solamente de inferir en, en, el, en el contexto que se está tratando. He'd like to meet the new employees tonight. Or they would, they would like to speak to a supervisor. Okay, question? Preguntas, preguntas? No, hola, teacher. hola, 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 hola. No, teacher. No, teacher. Si, por ejemplo, usted quisiera hablar con alguien de su empresa y usted le dice a alguien, I would like to speak to the boss, for example. Me gustaría hablar con el jefe. Entonces, de esa manera es que vamos a usar good like to de una manera cortés. Polite. Ok, no questions. No. No, teacher. Ok, hold on a second, please. I'm going to move forward here. Uh, okay, in exercise number four, uh, imagine a piece of equipment at your workplace is broken right from four uh, or five requests about it. What is that interaction talking about? ¿Qué, qué, ¿Qué comprenden de la instrucción? Veamos. Ok, imagine a piece of equipment at your workplace is broken right from four to five requests about, about it. Imagine una pieza de un equipo que esté de su trabajo esté rota, dice. Escriba cuatro o cinco formas de cómo preguntarla, dice. Ah, uh -huh. piece of equipment, your workplace is broken. Se quebró. Está quebrada la pieza. ¿Cómo haría usted para para relacionar ese contexto? 
Y ahí sería como para pedir ayuda, como yes, IT support yes, o yes. tech support. Yeah, okay. Re request. Usted va a hacer un request. Ah, uh, perfecto. I, I would like to report a piece broken. broken. Ah, ok, pues bien, that way. Ok, what else? Ok, uh, I'm going to give you some minutes in order that you can write it down. And then you are going to uh, share with the rest of the class. So I'm going to stop sharing here. Teacher, podría ser, I would like you to come and check the equipo, ¿cómo se dice? Equipment. Equipment. And then I would like to. Hola, hola. Hola, hola. Hola, hola, hola. Teacher. Hello. I would like to report an issue because my PC was broken. Oh, okay. Is correct? Okay. Okay. Me teacher. I want to participate. Okay, do it. I would like to know what happened with my coworker when they don't come to work. When, and when they don't have to don't come to work. Ah, they, they do not write well, okay. Another sentence. I would like to finish the report quickly. Okay. And, and also, I would like repair an old chest that was coming apart. Park. I would like to report some that is broken. Okay.
Okay. <clears throat> Somebody else wants to do it. Get mass. And teacher, my example, I would like to report a share broken. Is okay or no? Okay, remember uh, that uh, the main point here is that we are going to use the structure I would like to. If you I would like to, yeah, mm -hmm. I would like to. That is the main point. I would like to report a shale broken. Okay. Um, also, or, teach or maybe, maybe somebody can say, uh, I would like to ask you a question. See, sí, me gustaría hacer la siguiente pregunta. Yeah. Or me, or maybe I will like help me, please, with my issues. I would like to know if you can give me a hand with this problem. I you see. Uh, change it if you can. See, I would like to know. Me gustaría saber. Me gustaría saber yeah. Si yeah. I would like to know if you can give me a hand with this. Okay. Ese, okay. ese good like to, eso lo puedo combinar con cualquier verbo. Mm. Yeah. Okay, somebody else. ¿Quién más? Or, or maybe, teacher, I would like to talk um IT department. Okay. Because report my issues. Because I need report my issues, my issues. Because I, I would like to resolve my issue. I would like to resolve my issues. Okay. Yes. Okay, somebody else. Alguien más? Teacher, me. I would like to my computer. I would like pencil. I would like the the table. I would like. That to the table. Keyboard maybe. Okay, how can I, can I give you a more example? Of, okay, hold on a second. Well, um, okay. 
Okay, hold on a second. I need to share with you the structure in order that you can use it. Hold on, I, I, I got some info right here. Hold on a second, please. Okay, I'm going to share with you this info uh, in order that you can get more details about the topic right here in it is in Spanish. Okay, somebody wants to read it. Alguien quiere leerlo? Okay, it's thank you. Okay. Oh, Edwin, Edwin is there. Okay. Edwin. Okay. Oh, Gaby. Edwin. Ah, ok. Will es un verbo auxiliar que representa las terminaciones de los verbos españoles. Ría, rías, riamos, riáis y rían. Por ejemplo, compraría, viviríamos, vendrían, etc. Es el que se utiliza para la forma condicional en inglés. Lo que normalmente más le suena a la gente es I would like, me gustaría. Por ejemplo, me gusta, I like, me gustaría, I would like. Ok, veamos. Ah, si, okay. Si, si con ese texto veamos si les queda claro. Léanlo, por favor, léanlo, léanlo. Pueden tomar captura y enviarlo al grupo, por favor. Excuse me. Este, algún compañero que lo pueda este tomar captura y, y enviarlo al grupo. Ah, okay, okay, good idea. Thank you. Por ahí creo que sí ya se le enviaron. Yes, teacher. Rápido. Teacher, en ese caso que dice compraría, si yo digo que me gustaría comprar una casa, siempre incluiría el verbo buy. Por ejemplo, I would like to buy a house. Yes. Ok. Ok, let us see what else. Okay, alguien más, por favor, Gaby, ahora sí, your turn. I would like, o I'd like, es, expresa una idea de, la, de deseo, siendo muy formal. What would, what would la, you like? I would like a cup of tea. ¿Qué te gustaría tomar? Yo quisiera una taza de café. Would like siempre está seguido del infinitivo con el tú. Would like, would you like to come with us? ¿Te gustaría venir con nosotros? Sujeto más would like to más el verbo. He would like o he'd like to join the sales team. 
Él quisiera unirse al equipo de ventas. Ok. Me doy a entender con eso, ¿sí? Questions. ¿Alguien tiene alguna pregunta? Dime. Questions. No teacher. No questions. Okay, what about the negative and question? Could you read, uh, let me see. Somebody else, a volunteer who wants to read it. Alguien voluntario que quiera leer. Me teacher. Okay, Ingrid. Para formar las reacciones se añada not después de would, would, perdón, para formar would not que suele, se suele contraer a won't o como es esto, que me dice. Wouldn't. 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 Por ejemplo, sujeto más would not like to más verbo. Me gustaría ir. I would like to go. No me gustaría ir. I would not like to go. No me gustaría ir. I won't, I won't like to go. Wouldn't. Para formar las preguntas con would se invierten las personas o el sujeto y el would y tenemos la estructura would más la persona o sujeto like to y ver. Ejemplo, ¿te gustaría venir? Would you like to come? Okay, going back to the examples, uh, right here, subject plus good like to plus verb. Me gustaría ir is equal to say, I would like to go. No me gustaría, I could not like to go. Or it's better if I said, I wouldn't, I wouldn't like to go. I wouldn't like to go. Ahí estoy haciendo negativa. No me gustaría, I wouldn't, I wouldn't like to go. And then, aquí dice para formar las preguntas con Google, se invierten la persona o el sujeto y el good. Y tenemos la estructura. Primero va a ir good, después la persona o el sujeto. Eh, plus like to, plus ver. And we got an example. ¿Te gustaría venir? Would you like to come? Ok. Questions. For the third person teacher in negative? In negative? Yes. I podríamos decir she wouldn't like, she wouldn't like to, to come. She wouldn't like to come. Okay, we have some example. I would like to go off travel. I would like, I would not like to go on off travel. Would you like to go off travel? I would like to drive a Ferrari. I would not like to drive a Ferrari. And the question for us said, would you like to drive a Ferrari? Yes or no? Okay, uh, right now what I need is that you give me some example related with this. 
activity, but uh, let me see what else do we have here. Okay, let us continue with this. Okay, this is a reading. Uh, this is activity number six. Read about printer qualities and answer the question below. Okay, this is the third paragraph that we are going to read. Okay, color. Colors is important for users who need to print pages for presentation or maps and other pages where color is part, is part of the information. Color printers can also be set to print only in black and white. Color printers are more expensive to operate since they use two ink cartridges, one color and one black ink, that need to be replaced after a certain number of pages. User who don't have a specific need for color and who print a lot of pages will find a black and white printer cheaper to operate. Okay, veamos ese reading, por favor. I invite you to read it, please. And then you can, you can ask questions related with some words or instructions. Revisen ese párrafo, por favor, y preguntamos lo que sea necesario. Okay, questions? Okay, are, are you there? Yes? Hola, hola. Hello? Teacher, la pronunciación donde dice cartridge, cartridge, creo que es. Line number? Can, can you mean? Color, color printer are more expensive to operate since they use to in Cartridge. ¿O cómo se pronuncia ahí? Esa palabra, cartridge. 
This one. Correcto. Okay, let me erase first. Let me highlight it. I need to. Okay, hold on a second. I don't know if you are able to do something like that. No sé si ustedes tienen esa opción para, para poder este subrayar, eh, resaltar palabras cuando son así como esta, que son eh, como medias complicadas. No sé si lo pueden hacer, no. In my case, teacher, I use my cell phone. Ah, that is why. That is why, that is the reason why you can do it. Okay, uh, in this case, the right way to say the color printer are more expensive to operate since they use to in cartridge, one color, and one black ink. ¿Por qué está hablando de los cartuchos? Cartridge. Cartridge. This is plural. Cartridge. Okay, ahí está alguien marcando cheaper. Cheaper. ¿Qué significa cheaper, teacher? Eso es un adjetivo comparativo. Eso significa más barato. Chip es barato y agregado el ER es más barato. Ok. Ok, son Okay, anybody else? No? Okay, who wants to read it? Alguien que desee leer el, eh, el párrafo? Me too. Okay, go ahead. Color is important for users who need to paint page for presentation, presentations or maps and other page where color is part of the information. Color prints can also be set to paint only in black and white. And color prints are more expensive to operate since they used to in one color and one black ink. That need to be replaced after a certain number of plates. Usually, who don't have a specific need for color and who, and who will print a lot of the page with a black and white, clear and cheaper to operate. Okay. Okay, somebody else wants to do it? I try, teacher. Okay, go ahead, sir. Um, color is important for users who need to bring page for presentation or maps and other page where color is part of the information. Color printer can also be set to print only in black and white. Color printer are more expensive to operate since they used to in cartridge. One color and one black ink. They need to be replaced after a certain number of page. User 
could don't have a specific nick for color and who print a lot of page will find a black and white printer cheaper to operate. Okay, thank you. Somebody else? Hello? Teacher. Tell me. Hello? Hello. Okay, let us continue with the next paragraph. Okay, let us talk about resolution, printer resolution, the sharpness of stack and images of paper is usually measured in dots per inch DPI. Most inexpensive printer provide sufficient resolution for most purposes at 600 DPI. Speed, if you do my printer, the speed of the printer becomes, becomes important. Inexpensive printer prints only about three to six sheets per minute. Color printer, color printing is slower. More expensive printers are much faster. Memory, most printers come with a small amount of memory. For example, one uh, megabyte that can be expanded to the users. Having more than the minimum amount of memory is helpful and faster when printing out pages with large images or tables with lines around them, which the printer treats as a large image. Okay, questions? Hello, hello. Most inexpensive, more inexpensive, inexpensive printers. Expensive is an adjective. Inexpensive is the same word. Sharpness, sharpness. Sharpness. Y el significado de esa teacher. Es como la que la claridad que debe tener, porque está hablando de la resolución de la impresora. The sharpness of text and images of on paper. Okay. Teacher, sí se puede marcar porque yo desde mi celular lo estoy haciendo y sí se puede marcar. Ah, ok, ok, nice. Sí se puede, sí se puede. Okay, somebody else. Can mask. Okay, the one that you got at the beginning at the, on top, usually measure in ducts per inch. And they call it DPI. 
Eso se mide, las resoluciones se miden en, en puntos por pulgada. Eso significa DPI. In dog per inch. Okay, what else? ¿Qué más? Okay, let me see. You have um, helpful and faster when printing out pages. Y la última is it treats as a large image. Okay, I don't know if somebody wants to try to do it. Alguien que quiera desee leer, por favor. No? Anybody? Me, teacher. Okay. Ah. <laughs> Res resolution. Oh. Printer resolution. The sharpest of text and images in, on paper is actually measured in that in per sheet, per DPI. Inch. In that, in that per inch. In that per inch. Yes. DPI. Most inexpensive printers provide so so fine some resolution for most purpose at 600 dpi is speed if you do much is printing the speed of the printer becomes important inexpensive printer Printers print only about three to six sheets per minute. Color printing is slower. More expensive printers are much faster. Memory. Most printers come with a small amount of memory. For example, a megabyte. That can be expanded by the user. Having more than the, me the meaning amount of memory is helpful, helpful and faster when printing out page with large images and table with lines around the end around them, which the printer treats a large image. A large image. A large a image. Large image. 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 Okay, let us see some questions related with this reading. 
Okay, based on that, you are going to answer these five questions. So uh, try to write them down in your notebook, please. The first one said, why is color important for some user? Why? You need to give me a reason. Number two, what does uh, DPI stand for? So they stand for eso es se refiere a acronyms. ¿Y qué es lo que significa? Why are color printer more expensive? Tell me. Number four, what is something important for someone who prints a lot? And number five, what is the amount of memory that most printers come with? Okay, tell me, who wants to answer the first question? Just let me know, please, if you want to do it. O hacen una captura como quieran. ¿Hicieron captura? ¿Y eso no? I don't. I got it too. Okay, question number one, why is color important for some user? What can you tell me about? Hola, hola. Hola, hola. Hola, hola, hola. Sure. Hi, teacher. Okay, who wants to answer the first question? Well, um, I don't know if you already Wrote in your notebooks. No sé si ya las escribieron. Let me know, please. Okay, I'm going to stop sharing. Voy a dejar de compartir. Espero ya las haya escrito. En lo que usted termina, yo voy a, a, a revisar la asistencia.
Okay. Um, America. Present teacher. Okay, sir. Thank you, America. Uh, Anaïs. Present teacher. Blanca Esperanza. Blanca, Blanca is not here. Okay, Cecilia. Present teacher. Okay, uh, Edwin Alexis. Present teacher. Okay, set two. Uh, Edwin Alfredo. Present teacher. Francisco. Fran is now here. Gabriela. Present teacher. Okay. Gisela. It's now here. Ingrid Geraldina. Present teacher. Okay. Jonathan. Present teacher. Okay. Jose Ernesto. Present teacher. Don Jose Luis. Present. Okay, Karina. Karina Vanessa. Karina. Katherine Maricela. Present. Katherine Paola. Present teacher. Okay. Kenny Natalie. Present teacher. Mauricio Antonio. Present teacher. Okay. And Roxana Alvarez. Present teacher. Roxana Elizabeth. Present teacher. Sara. Present. Sara is there. Yes. Present teacher. Okay, Sara. Yes. Uh, Janet Del Carmen. Present teacher. Okay. And Yesenia Lisset. Present teacher. Okay, let me see. Bueno, entonces sería Blanca no está hoy. Eh, Francisco no está. Present Blanca is there. My goodness. Qué barbaridad, Blanquita. Y ya le estaba poniendo falla, por eso la llamé de nuevo. Y eh, Francisco. Y Gisela Guadalupe. Gisela Guadalupe. Gisela Guadalupe. No here. Okay, um, well, we are going to continue with the answer to uh, the questions tomorrow. But before you go, I would like to hear from you some sentences using uh, good light too. Veamos que bien. Me gustaría oír algunos ejemplos usando good light too. Me dicen, por favor. Me teacher. Uh, okay, got it. No, 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 the, the, the partner, the partner first. She, she first. No sé quién empezó a hablar antes que yo. 
Okay, go ahead. He will like to drink a coffee cup. And I wouldn't like to eat fish. Okay. Would you like eat the dinner with my family? Okay, what else? I would like to travel another country. I would like to travel around the country, okay. Me teacher. Okay, don't I will. I would like to sing with you. Uh -huh. I would like to sing in English with you. Okay, nice. Let us do it. Okay, somebody else. Alguien más? Teacher. Mi teacher. Okay, go ahead. I would like to report a family of the elevator machine. Okay. Okay, thank you, somebody else. You see, anybody? Teacher, I would like to sleep now. I would like to sleep now. <laughs> Me too, me too. Okay, thank you very much and I hope to see you tomorrow. Good night. Bye. Good night, Take care. Have a good night, teacher. Okay, good night. Time is over. Time is over. Bye-bye. Good night, teacher. Bye. Hello. He said it. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night.